if I'm going to hit top speed, I need to go all out, all the way down. Because it's not going to be dependent. It's not going to be dependent on where I want to hit top speed. It's going to be dependent on where the wind's at. More so the tailwind. So if I got a good tailwind at the top here, I got to utilize that. Like right here. Almost hit 40. Pretty close. You gotta look at the data. My heart rate 190. Wow. Whew. So here are the results for my ride. I'm trying to achieve 40 miles an hour, but I only achieved 39.6. I was so close. And in fact, the uh, the odometer on the video shows it at 39.8, which is really incredibly close. I'm not too sure if my heart rate sensor is reading properly because it shows 196 beats per minute and my heart rate has never been that high. So I'm thinking the sensor might have been a little bit too loose and it might have been too much of a gap between the sensor and the skin because most of my rides that I've done for this segment my average heart rate is probably in the 160s for this and there's been an occasion where some rides it's gone up to above uh, 180 but it's only been in the 180 heart rate range for less than like 30 seconds 
And most of these rides that I've done, it's just been 170, 160 zone most of the time. So I'm not too sure if that 196 is very accurate, but that's what it recorded and that's what's noted on the ride. I'm using the Immortal Spirit made by Moda Pecan. I put carbon wheels on it with rib spokes. And uh, this is the fastest this bike's gonna be, I believe. I, I bought a carbon fiber seat post that moves the seat as far forward so I can get more vertical over the pedals. And I have uh, the 45 degree angle drop stem on it, which I put on last year. I think you really have to be aerodynamic on these road bikes if you really want to achieve the very best times that you can. So I actually placed third overall in North Bendway Sprint. It's a discipline. You really have to practice sprinting to be efficient in sprints. If you don't practice sprinting, it's not going to be that easy to pull off the first time. So, practicing sprints. Did pretty good. Had favorable tailwind, so I thought it'd be a good time to go out there and see if I can hit 40 miles an hour. Thanks for stopping in and checking out what's going on. I'll see you guys at the next video. Bye.